106 miles to Chicago. We got a full tank of gas, half a pack of cigarettes. It's dark, and we're wearing sunglasses. Hit it. Michael Daughtry, and you are listening to New Music Saturday with Dr. Bones and the Mad Andersons. One. Hey, this is Ju- <laughs> hey, this is Julie Gimp. You are listening to Dr. Bones and Mad Andersons on New Music Saturday. Right on, and welcome to Music Saturday. And uh, those are two uh, uh, personal intros that uh, both Michael Daughtry and Julie Gimp did for us, and they're two very, very great people, and they're so much fun. And I think sometime soon that we should have Michael back on. I know we've had Julie back on uh, again a second time, but I think uh, I think uh, we should be all be in agreement that uh, Michael should come back on another time for some fun. Absolutely, he was he was great. Yeah, and he's a really talented guy. So awesome! And uh, right now we're gonna get uh, started off with the new compilation by NYC Factory Fast Records, and the first song here is a song by Hugo Fernandez and the song is called Kiki. Dig this. Thank you. 
That was Hugo Fernandez with Kiki. And uh, this, like I said, this whole compilation is all jazz. So we're trying to give different artists a chance and a uh, different chance, uh, a different venue to uh, give their music a chance. And, uh, you know, it, it was all right. Uh, pretty smooth flowing, a little off key, but not too bad. Yeah, I would tend to agree. Uh, the guitar player did a couple of nice things. Uh, the sax solo sounded good. Yeah, it had it had some really nice atmospheric qualities, and I just have to actually insert here. Um, I, I kind of feel bad for the artist. I don't have uh, any background or expertise in jazz, so I feel like I'm woefully underqualified to comment on it. So, but I have to say that the sound of the recording was good. They did a nice job recording it. So. You know what? I'm in agreement with you because uh, the same thing for myself is like I mean, I I, I wasn't a plain jazz, but. Uh, I don't have the background in either, so we're trying to make the best of it. So next up is a gentleman named Jordy Gasper, and this one's called Hey Jude, Hey Gaza. Dig this. <laughs>
All right, that was Jordy Gasper with Hey Jude, Hey Gaza. Now, that was really, really slow. Um, not as uh, intense is the wrong word, but not as uh, upbeat as I expected it to, but it still flowed for fairly well. But uh, more or less a lounge song, and I'm going to leave it at that. Yeah, it was a very interesting mood piece. Uh, I'd be curious to know what the bowed instrument was. It, it had a really interesting tone to it. I couldn't tell if it was a cello or a bass. Or I'm, I'm going to go out on a limb and say it. I, I think it was a cello. I'm not certain. Um, yeah, it really set an interesting atmosphere, but yeah, really, really understated. You know, no, I'm with you. I'm not sure either. And Catherine, like... I, I I know you're you're more or less the, the, the instrument person for that sort of thing, but uh, yeah, I'm not 100 percent sure on that one either. I I can easily be wrong. Can you? Pretty Pretty much time, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> well, 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 we'll just we'll just agree to disagree and say she's right. So. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds yeah. like a recursive loop. It is. Yeah. <laughs> Moving on. Yeah. Well, well, next up, we have the, the Nova trio. And uh, just a quick little side note. As we know, the Chevy Nova didn't sell very well in Mexico because Nova means no go. So <laughs> the, the, there you go. For people who know about that, there's a little side kind of random fact for you. <laughs> so here's a Nova trio with a Picorus, I believe. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right. So let's get to this. Dig this. Thank <laughs> you. 